Burkhanism or Akjang Altai, Akyar is a new religious movement that flourished among the indigenous people of Russia's Gorno-Altai region between 1904 and the 1930s. Tsarist Russia was suspicious of the movement's potential to stir up native unrest and perhaps involve outside powers. The Soviet authorities ultimately suppressed it for fear of its potential to unify Siberian Turkic peoples under a common nationalism. Originally millenarian, charismatic and anti-shamanic, the Birkinist movement gradually lost most of these qualities. Becoming increasingly routine, institutionalized, around a hierarchy of oral epic singers, and accommodating itself to the pre-existing Altaian folk religion. It exists today in several revival forms. On the whole, the Birkinist movement was shown to be a syncretistic phenomenon combining elements of ancient pre-shamanist, shamanist, Lamaist and Orthodox Christian beliefs. According to a professor of Tomsk State University L. Shostova, it emerged in response to the needs of a new people, the Altai Kizhi or Altaians who sought to distinguish themselves from the neighboring and related tribes and for whom Birkinism became a religious form of their ethnic identity. <inaudible> <inaudible> Origins of the name Birkinism is the usual English-language scholarly name, which has its origin in the Russian academic usage. One of the Birkinist deities is Ak Birkin, or White Birkin. Birkin means God or Buddha in Mongolic languages, yet Birkinism is not considered Buddhist, as the term is also used in shamanistic nomenclature. For example, in Mongolian shamanism, the name of the most sacred mountain, the rumored birthplace and final resting spot of Genghis Khan, is also Birkin Kaldan. Ak Birkin is only one of a pantheon of deities worshipped by Birkinists see list below, but Ak Birkin nevertheless provides the name of the religion in Russian, and thence into other languages. The Altaian name for the religion is Ak Jang White Faith. White refers to its emphasis on the upper world in the three-world cosmology of the Turkic and Mongolian Tengriism. Alternatively, the name may also allude to Ak Jang's rejection of animal sacrifices in favor of offerings of horse milk or horse milk alcohol. Jang means authority, faith, custom, law or principle, and canon or rules of ensemble. In more colloquial settings, the term may also be used as a way of doing things, and is used in reference to religions as well as political systems. <laughs> <laughs> Early history In April 1904 Chet Chelpin or, and his adopted daughter Chuggle Sorok Chandik reported visions of a rider dressed in white, and riding a white horse. This figure, whom they called Ak Birkin, White Birkin announced the imminent arrival of the mythical messianic hero Oirat Khan who was actually a real historical figure—Koit Oirat Prince Amersana. The central figure in the research of Birkinism in the past 40 years, however, has demonstrated that Oiro Khan is a mythologized image of the Jingar past of the people of Altai Kiji. Chet and Chuggle gathered thousands of Altaians for prayer meetings, initially in the Tering Valley. These were violently suppressed by mobs of Russians, instigated by the Altaian spiritual mission, who were afraid of the potential of the competing religion to decrease the Orthodox Christian flock in Altai. Chet and Chuggle were arrested, Chuggle was released, and after a prolonged trial Chet was fully exonerated by court and released in 1906. Researcher Andrei A. Znamensky see article below compares the Birkinist movement to other indigenous revitalizing movements around the world, such as the Native American ghost dance or the Melanesian cargo cult. An excruciatingly detailed treatment of the comparisons and comparability of Birkinism with the Melanesian cargo cult, the Mennonites, the Dukobas of Georgia, the Mariatsi of Nizhny Novgorod, and many other movements, is provided in Shostova's dissertation from the 1980s. Zanemensky says the prime motivating factor was Altaian's fear of displacement by Russian colonists, Russification, and subjection to taxation and conscription on the same basis as Russian peasants. Andrei Vinogradov thesis link below sees Birkinism as a typical nomadic Turco-Mongolian mobilization pattern aiming to link families and clans SEOK into a steppe empire which in this case never materialized. The Birkinist's veneration of heroes from oral epics, he says, serves much the same cultural centralizing function as the veneration of other divine heroes such as Gezar, Manus, or Genghis Khan. As such it constitutes a major aspect of Turco-Mongolic religion, distinct from shamanism. After the arrest of Chet and Chuggle, Tyri Akamchi arose to become the most prominent Ilikchi, and helped organize the movement. Having been exposed to Buddhism through his years as a translator in Mongolia, Tyri added a number of Buddhist trappings to Birkinist ritual, such as bells. Within a decade, most of the Altaian population had joined the new faith. In 1918 Gregory Koros Gherkin and other Altaian leaders declared the formation of something called the Karakoram Regional Committee, 
Karakorankaya Okrasnaya Uprava, with the object of establishing an Oirat Republic. This was intended to include not only Altai but also neighboring republics of Tuva and Karkasia. It was forcibly dissolved with arrival of Bolshevik power in 1921. Deities Burkhanism accepts the three worlds of Mongolic and Turkic tradition. These are the upper, middle, and lower worlds in other words, heaven, earth, and the underworld, however, it rejects worship of traditional deities associated with the underworld. In addition, it imports into worship many figures from Altaian oral epic lore, which were not worshipped in the shamanic part of the Altaian religion. Uch Kerbustan. Uch means three, while Kerbustan comes from the Soktian Kormazta", and thence from the Avestan Ahura Mazda. Thus, a triune god. Though imported from oral epics, Uch Kerbustan is a generalized spirit rather than a hero of stories with a personality. He may be analogous with the Turco-Mongolian high god Tengri heaven. Rather than an import from Buddhism, Christianity, or Turkic Islam, this particular trinity is likely to have been inspired by other triune gods and heroes from Turkic culture sometimes in the form of a god with three sons. Uch Kerbustan is connected with the following three messianic heroes, also from Altaian oral epic lore. Oirat or Golden Oirat mythological ancestor of the Western Mongols. A conflation, dim historical memory of a number of real-life Western Mongolian leaders from around the 17th century including Galdan Seren, Amursana a legendary Khoit Oirat chieftain who fled Chinese territory for Russian after the 1756 king destruction of Jingaria, Shunu Wolf. The Altaian version of Asina, the totemic lupine ancestor recognized by various Turkic peoples, the gods of the upper world, or Rutos pure ancestors are considered fragments or emanations of Uch Kerbustan. Birkinism calls these Birkins. Among them are Ak Birkin, white Birkin, depicted as an old man with white hair, a white coat, and white headgear, who rides a white horse. Possibly analogous to the Mongolian white old man. Sagan Ebugan, a symbol of good fortune, Jajik a formless spirit mediator, assists with human divine communication. Vinogradov compares with the Holy Spirit. Altaians distinguished between an Ak Jajik, white Jajik, who carried messages to the gods of the upper world, and a Sari Jajik, yellow Jajik, who did the same for gods of the middle world, and is identified with the hearth, Umay the goddess of childbirth and children. Other Turkic law but not the Altaian makes her the consort of the high god Tengri, and thus a primordial mother figure, Oin, the mother of fire. Worshipped before every sacrifice, but especially during one of the three major Birkinist festivals gods of the Middle World, i.e. the familiar spheres of nature and human affairs—include numerous local spirits, such as spirits associated with mountains or springs or masters of the game. They may also be associated with particular clans More generalized ones include Altai Easy, the Master of Altai, a sort of genius loci, suitably adapted for an Altaian national consciousness, Ulgan a spiritual ancestor of several Altaian clans. Originally a proper name, now generalized. Some sources describe Ulgan as the creator of the universe in Birkinist theology, this is probably a misunderstanding. Historically, Birkinism rejected the traditional gods of the underworld, notably Erlik, Yerlik, its chief. This rejection is closely related to Birkinism's rejection of Altaian shamanism, and corresponding elevation of oral epic singers Yalikchi, by shaman, is here meant Manyaktu Kams, i.e. the costume-wearing specialists who communicate with the underworld gods. Both rejections are likely to have been inspired by oral epic lore, which regularly features shamans as villains. Topic. Practices. Burning juniper for blessing, purification, or healing Home or hilltop altars or mergul, with candles and milk offerings Erecting of cans obu. Recitation, composition, patronage of oral epics Divination and weather control Display of white and yellow ribbons or streamers from trees or strings, or dangling from the back of one's headgear Prayer while standing, with hands raised, or with prostrations Celebration of festivals Shutton or Mergul, a semi-annual spring and fall festival dedicated to Uch Kerbustan. 
Chok or Jajik Chokta a fall festival dedicated to Jajiks. Otakir dedicated to Oen. Some sources speak of a list of 20 commandments for Birkinism. The evidence for this is sparse. Alcohol and tobacco were prescribed in the early years. Chuggal came to be venerated as the main recipient of the original message. This was much less true of Chet, although both were addressed with honorific titles. Notable Birkinists Grigory Koros Gherkin, a Soviet landscape artist and leader of the Karakoram Executive Committee. Birkinism today Russian painter Nicholas Rorik and his wife Helena Rorik passed through Altai in 1926. Nicholas painted Oira Messenger of the White Birkin based on his understanding of the movement. Note that the painting's title apparently gets the theology backward. It was rather White Birkin who was the messenger for Oirat, followers of Agni Yoga, an esoteric movement founded by the Roeriks, have encouraged a recent revival of interest in Birkinism among non Altaeans. At the same time, they have insisted on a link with Tibetan Buddhism and a veneration of Mount Belaka, elements not found in traditional Birkinism. A number of Birkinist revival organizations emerged during the 1990s, mostly as attempts to formulate or preserve an Altaian ethno nationalist identity. To that end many of them have been persuaded to reconsider earlier Birkinism's vexed relationship with shamanism and, or Buddhism. A list of movements follows, with the name of a founder or leading supporter in parenthesis. For more information see Agnieszka Halimba's article linked below. Ak Jang Altaichi Sanashkin Ak Sana DZ Hanna Alexeva Teneri Nina Antonova and Daniel Mamiev Ak Suus Nikolai Shodoev Ak Jang Sergei Kaisnev Aguru Jan, no single leader. Topic: English language sources. Andrei Zinomensky, Power of Myth. David Johnson, What was and is Birkinism. Andrei Vinogradov, Ak Jang in the context of Altai religious tradition. Agnes Kahalemba, Contemporary religious life in the Republic of Altai. Nikolai Shadoev, Altai Bilix about the sky and Birkins. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Russian language sources. Russian language source available for free from the publisher is being translated into English in 2016. Istoki Religii i Etnosa, Birkinism, Sources of Religion and Nation, Tomsk State University Press, 2010, a reproduction of Shurstova's dissertation from 1986, which was a result of the author's ethnographic expeditions to Altai in 1976 to 1985. Shurstova, Lyudmyla. Tyna Dolony Tering, The Secret of the Tering Valley. Gorno Altusk, 1997 https://lccn.loc. Gov. 98189212